Hi folks, and welcome back to Star Sector and the Blade Breaker Deserter campaign and the tales of Athena Yamada. Last time, we ended up here in Ragnar Complex doing some food sales. We did a fight here with the Ragnar Complex Defense Station, which we won, but we lost a lot of ships. We also actually lost the, um, our, um, Kalkultaroi, I think is what it's called. Um, so yeah, we lost that as well. So, you know, it wasn't the ultimate success I wanted it to be, but hey, was all right. Let's give you, let's see what do you want. Here, you go take that. Enjoy third shift. Uh, yes, no, take Lindsay Fraser. Lindsay Fraser can do that. Um, you can go for that one. And Reese four, or can you put Reese four? Reese four can go to, go to the authority, Reese four. Right, okay. We are under crude, as per usual. Uh, a lot of ships need repairing anyway. We got ourselves a new Sunder. Well, basically we have to leave here now so we can repair up. Especially because we might be getting chased down. So, yeah. Let's just leave. Remove the Go Dark, because Go Dark isn't really, hurt, isn't really helping us right now. Yeah, that 13,000. Pretty certain that was from the... What do you have here, actually? This is a Scavenger and Cabal fleet. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Right. Uh... Quick trip back to Besson to unload, maybe? I do need crew from somewhere, and I'm not going to get it from Besson, am I? No, I'm not. So... What's the situation? Um... Cottle, maybe? Let's try, let's try Cottle. See if you can hit that. What's the best place to hit that? And, uh... Get some... It's over there, right? Yeah, it's over there. All right, so let's go dark. What's that? That is a perspective fleet. We're going to jump in while going dark, so we're pretty, pretty stealthy. We're actually also in the base. Not in the base, sorry. Okay. Are they far? Are they moving away? They're moving away. Gotcha. Right. Um, let's do some sales then. Sell the stuff I don't particularly want, like you and um. Eh, no, we're mostly okay. Right. So we'll we'll uh, sell that off. Sell those off. Sell that off. Pop those. Okay, right. Sort. I need some crew. Need some supplies. Cottle's actually quite well equipped, isn't it? Yeah, it's inconvenient, annoyingly. But fine, I guess we'll do it this way. We'll have to pay a lot of money for this, but it means actually we get quite a few supplies. Okay, we'll confirm that. Good fleet. Right, let's start refitting these as best we can. It's not going to be perfect, but it's, it's what we're going to have to do at the moment. What can we do here? Diva Kaz Heavy Beam. Probably the best we're going to get at the moment. Uh, firstly, we're going to give you an ITU, because no matter what we put in there, an ITU is going to be useful. Um, Diva Kaz Heavy? That is... A burst damage of 4,266. Alright, can we put on the sides there? A couple of medium CPCs. Pump that as far as it'll go. I've got... Wow, I've got no small missiles. I have little to no small missiles there. And some point defense. What can we do for point defense? Um... That'll do, and let's give us eight left over. Eight left over means we could do uh, 
that and one, two, three, four, five, six. That is worth it. So that means the total thing is 831 for a flux dissipation of 660. I'll take that. Um, you're not called the inevitable though, you're gonna get called something else. You are the BBD uh, a dad joke. I'm not sure if they were asking for me to come up with a dad joke or call it a dad joke. And I realize that calling it a dad joke works both ways. Uh, volley guns, a couple of night light needlers, pump that up, give you the ITU. And what can we give you in the middle there? What did you have before? That's the big one. What did you have there before? So you have a range of 700 on you. So it's something of similar range. Not as much. Um, that's fine. That's okay. We'll give you a... I think I can see DC and then... You require what? 10 for the... That. What can I get away with? I want less flux. The six. Scaler on sixty-three. Pulse laser is three three three. That's not too. That's too high. It's too high. Take another fan laser. To be honest, just take another fan laser. You're basically flying around with auto pulse lasers and auto with and light needlers and some fan lasers as point defense. Sofa king, you can do that. Uh, Mancer. You actually have nothing at the moment, right? There's literally nothing here I particularly can use usefully. So you're being relegated to are not fixed at the moment. Right, you high. Gale batteries, shellback ACs. We've lost a couple of those. I've got I should have I should have some rail guns here to help counteract that. But we lost a lot of stuff here. That's actually really bad. Your mismatch is not Put you in a good place, has it? No, it has not. All right, we'll have to like we'll refit you back at the base. We'll refit you back at base. Same with you, I think. We'll have the pulse laser there. And do you have an LRPD laser? We do. Missiles there. What can we do here, missiles wise? I have a couple of swarmers. Uh, again, you have the unholy alliance though. That is a problem. That's the unholy alliance there. Hmm. ITU will do this trick there. Reinforce bulkheads. Max that out. Uh, that gives us 15 left. What can we do with 15? Um, 15 gives us what? Fifteen percent. That gives me twenty percent plus the glitz sensor. Now that is not worth it. I'm going to drive field, doesn't really do what I want it to do. Mm-hmm. Okay, um Stabilize Shield is six. That's just about enough. I'll do that. There you go. And then we'll just hit that. There. And Dawn's Wrath, you lost your big gun anyway. Take a sample turn with Peter. That. And laser, fan laser. PD laser. ITU. Harden subsystems. Yeah, that'll have to do. That'll have to do. It's not great, but it'll have to do. I'll have to refit you back at the base. Um, right, let's move you up. I'll put you guys up here as well. Need to be refit to the base. You're technically the most, you're technically the combat capable ship I've got here, so I'll put you there. Alright. Do you want repairs? Am I selling anything? Not as such. Right. Um, officers. Three Olympus. That's Ivan the Not-So-Bad, actually. And you're a carrier, pack, carrier pilot. An aggressive carrier pilot. Interesting. Sounds good. We'll take you along. 
Uh, we're going to put you in, though. Probably in you, to be honest, for the Olympus. Which means that Reese can go... Actually, yeah, we put you there, because you've got more wings to deal with. You've got more wings to deal with there. Right, back to base. Back to base. While well, I still got a base to get back to, because... Are we here? Yeah, let's sneak out again. Let's get out of here. Collection neutrino clear ceasefire. Is that one of my fleets? Or is that a Borken fleet? I couldn't tell. It's a Borken fleet. Anything useful there? No. I am looking for a Bassetan, but not for the reason you think. Basically. Uh, right. Price is anything prices over here? Galatia. Food is. Havaha. And Ragnar Complex food is cheap as chips. And food is sort of, hmm. You could be, there's definitely money to be made in that sort of run. Uh, back to Besson, however. Um, we're still looking to do the... See, it's less, that's less... Uh, dropping out Lucille, or... Like, the Lucille is probably the best. I mean, of course, for Besson. Yeah, Besson, okay. What's that? That is a pirate fleet. The pillaging of Pendulum de Grange. Salvage fleet returning to raise Velg. So you're returning to raise Velg. I kind of want to go after you, to be honest. I kind of want to go for you, because if you're returning to raise Velg, that means you've... You've salvaged what you wanted to salvage, I guess. Is that what that means? Guess we're gonna find out. You got Sebastian F. Bass combat freighter as well. Wouldn't mind having you, but yeah, let's go in. Threat transfer command? Nah, we cool. We good. Full combat engage? Not you. Uh, other than that, yes. Deploy. Um, let's do some checking first of all. Right, the ECM rating is so high that capturing uh, Central Gemma is irrelevant. I'll just put Defend Order there and there. We'll automatically pick up the Nav Buoy along the way. You're so eager, aren't you? You also got those SRM pods, which I actually haven't actually checked. I actually haven't leveled up in a while either, have I? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's get in there and just save our buddy. There you go. Didn't quite save him entirely, but caused it to back out and I overloaded the thing. So, I'll take it. Hello, you are a Cersei class. You're Nautilus class. I'm obliged to like you, Nautilus, by your name alone. Okay. Where's the wall? Where is the wall? The wall. Go over there. We've been ready to engage. What, those, what were those shots? I wonder what were those shots? Those red, like little flashy shots. I just had pulsar weapons, but I haven't really seen them. Not the neutrino pulsar, the um, the imperial ones, but I haven't really seen them, and they're a bit more orange than they are red. Flash her down. Shark down.
I do like the uh, IR, actually. I wasn't sure if I'd like the IR uh, point defense. Because I, I keep thinking of it like the, um, the disruptors that I believe are added by... Was it Mayor that added disruptors? That can't be, because Mayor disruptors are also in this game. I don't have Mayor installed. Yeah, but I don't know who in, who actually added the uh, them to start with. But the disruptors and the hacking comlinks. I never found they did what they wanted it to do, whereas these IR ones are doing exactly what I want them to do. You can see, you can physically see them actually sort of derail the entire. Uh, let's lose this, that and let's lose that as well. You can move back to your area of expertise. Where am I? I'm over here. I can turn around and deal with these guys. Oh, what was it? It might have been a CPC. Ooh. Straight into the engines. Boom. Good. Hey, Sasuke. Can't... You can't run away from me. Not when I'm like this. Griffin's out of missiles. Is that including the uh, auto forge? Hope you're not wasting your auto forge. Pulse lasers, IR pulse lasers, point defense lasers. Ooh, there you go. Cersei down. The Sebastus is still alive. Why is the Sebastus still alive? Everybody just kill, focus on that Sebastus, please. The entire job of this is to kill it, and that's why we're here. That's not a hyperbole, that's kind of why we're here. It's gonna be able to run away, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Well, I guess we're chasing that then. Yep, we're chasing that, because that's the main point of all this. Go after these guys. The new to disengage, we will pursue. We will take him out of the action. I will be coming in. Um, as will you, 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 you. You... Sure, uh, that'll do. Priority targets include you, 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 you. Let's get in there, and we have to deal with that. I'm gonna focus- I'm focusing my target on the Sebastos, because that's the biggest they've got, I think. Besides, the Angon is not really gonna do a lot. There you go. That's one adds he's gonna go down. I'm giving it a little homicidal here, I, I get it. But, you know. Okay. You go there. With a proper eliminate order, actually. Yeah, you just chase that down, please. You, you chase that down. You kill all those guys off. Eliminate order on you as well. Three, two, one. Good. Nautilus down. That ads is going to be able to run, isn't it? Medusa, that's literally your job and your only job. Catch up to it, please. Come on, let's get in there. Stop it. There you go. Thank you. You slowed it down a little bit. Look what we wanted. Go 
good. That's you done. The Phaeton's down. Everything's down, correct? Yeah. Everything is down. Ship recovery time. Anything useful for us? The Challenger with compromised armor. I am lacking in the frigate second. <laughs> Hello, Hound. Badger makes a comeback. Um, we have a hammerhead already, but again, I wouldn't say no to another one, I guess. We need to rebuild our, fr our frigate complement. Um, challenger? Sure, I'll take a challenger. Hecate. Degraded engines now. I'll say no to that. Unholy alliance. Structural damage. That's fine. Yeah, we'll take these. I'll take these three. Um, right. Yes. I also need to keep an eye on where I'm doing my sales because, of course, I need to... The whole part of my thing is just try to salvage a bit of reputation with the independents. And if, if I want to sell into slavery, you need to sell into slavery in systems where there aren't any independent stations. So I shot myself in the foot there last ep last couple of episodes. Okay, I'll take all that. You'll take all that? Yeah, we'll take all that. Yes, a lot of people leveled up. That's good. I leveled up. Hurrah. That hasn't happened in a while. Um, technically, still officer management, I suppose. We'll work on getting officer management up to 10. Because I'm never going to say no to more of those, am I? Unless I get some really weird... Uh, are we going the right way? Via Besson, via Besson jump point, eh? Okay. Right. Yeah, I guess that is the best way to do it. Because you also avoid the uh, massive magnetic field around the star. Which I guess is something to be concerned about, which I hadn't taken into consideration. There we go. Full speed ahead. Uh, Novi Mir, Starforge captured by Knights Templar. They're going crazy again. All right. Boop. All right, okay, so first things first. Transfer cargo and personnel. Drop off everything that I consider to be combat worthy. So that when we leave here, the only things I want to... S the only weapons that should be on my ship are things that I want to sell. Ooh, hang on, I got... The, where are they? Get back here. You're keepable. You can sell. You're keepable. You're kept. Uh, yeah, we don't keep these here on now for now. Step that in, that can stay, that can go, those can go back in, those can go back in. That is correct. That is correct on this front. What about on this front here? Do I have any, do I have any weapons in here that I have kept over eagerly? That's the big question. Have I had any weapons here that I've kept too eagerly? The weapons that I would otherwise be selling. Barago LRMs can go away. Heavy Eastern Pulse Cannons can go away. Um, these are the Void Spear SRMs. Light Assault Guns, probably. If you start getting like double stacks of these, we'll start selling them off. Even though 47 is probably way too much. I can, I can probably just get rid of these. So many of them. Um, traverse Cannons, that can probably go. Shuttle Deliverers probably can go as well, if you're brutally honest. Um, those can leave. Those can go. Defense Alternator has never really worked for me, but I'll keep it around for the time being. You can leave. You're a bit too inaccurate for my tastes. You can go away. You're way too short-ranged for my tastes. Those can go away. Um, what are you? You are Fated S. Flaxure. A couple of Ibises. We're going to need you. Uh, shard Guns can go. Burst shell, we only have one, that's the problem. Contender can go. Crackler is okay, Disruptor. Yeah, these things are supposed to actually missile jammer beam. I don't remember what adds you, but I don't think you work as well as the IR beams that I've got on the um, Sparrowhawk. Um, linear chain gun, electro repeaters, magic PD missile, magnetar, burst, PD beamers, polarizers. Small target painters. Raise the damage dealt to the target by 50%. Double the chances of disabling the weapons and engines. Low power laser. Use the light priority targets for other conventional weapons. It is quite useless by itself. It can also be used to map hulls. But given that doing so it tends to fright unshielded. So... 
I want to use that. 15% is not nothing to be sneezed. 15% is huge. That's, that's essentially getting an entire extra tier of weapon ordnance perk. If, if a tier 4 was allowed, for example, because you're getting the tier 3 all over again. Strumble S can go. Uh, and tactical shop, we can stay behind. Any of these guys want to leave? Now nah, we're good. All right, fine. Right. Uh, you're actually working okay. You're actually working all right. Yeah, those are working okay for the time being. Now we want to. Okay. I need to get some new names from my list. Because you have three names, I've only got two names down here. Uh, what about you? I've got because I've got one, haven't I? I've got one hammerhead, big popper. Um, right, strip. What can we do here? What can we use well? A couple of telems, possibly. A couple of glow tusks. Again, that's kind of what the other one has, right? The other one is armed with a couple of glow tusks, so not as appealing as it would otherwise be. Um. Couple of great of HMCs. A couple of heavy maulers. A couple of heavy needlers, there you go. A couple of heavy needlers, and we'll give you some some big damaging missile. Some kind of big damaging missile. Um a couple of harpoons. And point defense. Have you got stacks of a point defense? We've got stacks of Vulcans? We haven't actually got stacks of Vulcans, that's true, right? We have not actually got stacks of Vulcans. If I'm correct in remembering. Oh, we do have a stack of Vulcans. Cool. I stand corrected. Um, we're going to go for a... Uh, ITU. Bulkheads. Bring that up. And that gives me... Uh, gives me RFCs if I really wanted to. I want expanded missile racks. I need that yeah, should do for expanded missile racks, right? There you go. That means that's up to six of those, correct? It's doubles? Yeah, double. Done. I'll rename you at another point. I'll have to, I'll have to re rename this between this episode and next episode as I get some more names on the list. Uh, you are actually the Night Manager again. I just I just find it amusing. Um, hopefully a sledge cannon will mean you actually stay back this time. <laughs> stay far, far away. Do not go in close. Uh, and I'm also going to give you the ITU, just for because you have even longer range now. So your range is going to be 1,650. Um, unreliable subsystems, let's get around that. That, there's going to be six left over. What can six do? What can we do with six? Bulkheads, because the joke is that you last forever. Yeah, there you go. So you can basically fire forever. Because the second you stop firing one of your weapons, you'll start losing, you'll start losing flux. All right. Uh, and you are the Challenger D. So you have two composites. Medium ballistic frontwards, a front medium ballistic. Take a twin linear, and then we'll give you I'll give you a uh, take a crackler because that's a one off. It's a one off at the back. Um, any missiles want to go in for this? Couple of Achilles. No, 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 no. I'll take. Um, I do want to take missiles, but I'm not going to take those. I'm going to take something else. Void spears. I'll take some void spears. ITU. Bulkheads. Yeah, that'll do. Um, sure. Give you a name. That's uh, right, you. Because. Uh, I want the Achilles for this lot. We need the Achilles here. Uh, where are the Achilles? Achilles are six OP, so we need you to find Achilles. There, there, there. The shell backs are gonna have you. Are gonna be a problem. 
They are going to be a problem. The problem I'm going to solve with the use of railguns. Um, I see use max that out there. Um, this is 4 OP, so the Ibises are down here at 4. Where is it? Uh, Ibis, there and there. Dual flat cannons, right. So that gives us the ability to use... We actually have no Wanzer wings whatsoever, really. Uh, Dart SRM rack, Achilles SRM rack, focused particle lance. Go nuts. Uh, that gives me what? Gale battery, Gauss cannon, Mjolnir. So that's the Gale battery's range of 900. High explosive. Devastated cannon, 900. 240, it's higher. Mark 9 auto cannon, Mjolnir. The Gale battery is kind of what I want to do. That's kind of working the best. And. Give you bulkheads. That gives me 10 points to spare. 10 points can give me essentially RFCs. Yeah, give you some RFC and a point there. Is it the correct way of doing it? Let's do uh, that. That, 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 that. I think. Yeah, that's the way we want to do it. Uh, we can also alternate the railguns. There you go. That's, that'll be that. And you just need two something or others. So we're just, I can't give you two antimatter blasts. We've toyed with this before. It's pointless. You can't actually use them. Um, a couple of micro capacitor micro lasers. Um, possibly. Possibly. Um, no, there literally is nothing here, is there? Well, it looks like I'm going to go for the, um, what was it? Uh, the couple of VR post lasers. Give you range. Just max that out. Just max that. Actually, is that too much? That's too much. We'll That's actually fine as it is. That works there. Gives me 10 points left. With 10 points, I can give it hardened shields. Christ knows why. And uh, is 4 points left. 4 points left gives me a extended shield. Which I can't do anyway, can I? I can't add extended shields onto this thing because of the Neutronium Sigma upgrade. Um, yeah. Can't actually change the shields at all. Sure, I guess. Right, that's repaired. That's... We got what we wanted to get off this. Yes. Next time, folks, we'll... Uh, Go do something, I guess. How are we doing over here? Yeah, it's fine, 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 fine. Fine. The Shadow Claw's still there. The War Spite, again. I need to be able to, like, to dump 600,000 into space so I can take this back. Or alternatively, just forget the War Spite exists. Just rename this the War Spite and take this out the second I can repair it. Anyway. I'll catch you guys next time, folks. See you then. Bye.